I will never, ever leave my parents' house. I'm 18 years of age. People my age uh, are so brainwashed by people, by these 16-year-old kids earning 10k a month and with their independency. They believe leaving their, their parents' house at age 18, going into debt, having this one-bedroom one room apartment, working this minimum wage job, struggling to put food on their table, all those uh, mental health issues just because they want to be independent how sad how pathetic i'll never ever leave my parents house i could be 30 and i'm still living in my parents house you want to know why because i'm not fooled by the western media i'm not fooled by your sick ideology the only time that anyone should leave their th parents house is when it is your time to get married. When it's your time to get married, you're leaving a heart, you're leaving a scar, you're leaving something, and you're taking all that love to this family, to that one woman. But but if you're not if you're not getting married and you're just leaving the parents house for for trying to be responsible, the the truth is that many people that many people that leave their parents house at such a young age is that you're not leaving for responsibility or independency you're leaving for your own desires for your own selfish needs and just pleasure that's the real truth you get fucked up you get high you do degenerate shit and then what do you do next you're wasted if you live in your parents house you're working maybe you're not, your dad's working maybe someone else is working networking building that money up and who's cooking? Your mother's cooking. You know, you can save on the cooking. You can help with your mom with the cleaning and all that stuff. Who has a shower? Well, like you could pay half the rent. Your dad pays the rent. You pay the rent. You're still being independent, and responsible by knowing about money, by knowing how to clean yourself, all this other stuff, by by having people around you to motivate you and to give you advice of what not to do, what to do, what not to do, while being independent, and responsible. But once, once you leave your parents' house at age 18 without having any reason whatsoever by living in a one-bedroom apartment, what advice do you have? What advice is going to get given to you? What is your purpose leaving your parents' house at such a young age by just living in a disgusting one-bedroom apartment and earning minimum wage? What are you doing with your life at such a young age living alone and not knowing what to do? You don't know how to cook. You don't know how to clean uh, Part of the bed sheets. You don't have to do. You don't have to like. Uh, put what, what when to put the dishwashers in. You don't have to do any of the basics. Uh, house chores, but you want to live alone. And even if you do know the uh, know how to do the basic house chores, you're gonna you're gonna get frustrated. You're gonna get bored. Like, oh, what the fuck, bro? I keep doing these basic ass house chores and when I was at home, I didn't really have to do much because my, my mom was mostly doing it and I was only doing only a bit of basic house chores like my stuff. You're going to have that mental, mental you're going to have that type of mentality and you're going to end up regretting you living, living alone. Understand? It doesn't make sense for, I don't, it doesn't make sense at age 18 to live alone. You can, at age 18, if you live with your parents, and you're working, if you're working, you're getting your card right. You have your own driver's license. Or you're working to get your driver's license. You're trying to learn new skills. Trying to network with people. All those stuff, that's all independent and responsible. All those stuff does not require you to leave your parents' house and live in some dirty one-bedroom apartment and live a depressed life. You could be independent and responsible without leaving your parents' house like a scumbag. The people who leave their parents are at such a such an age with without no without any reason is a, are scumbags and absolute pieces of shit. But the parents who force their people, force their children to leave at such a young age, are equally scumbags. Are equally are equally pieces of shit. Are equally worse. Because how are these parents telling these 18, 16, 17 year olds or eighteen year olds, oh if you don't get your money up, all the stuff you're gonna leave the house. Or if you get your money, oh, you have a job now. You have to leave the house. You have to be independent. 
How does that make any sense? What does you living on your own connect with just independency? It doesn't connect at all. It's just stupidity. You could be responsible in many ways, as I, as I listed before. Getting your car right, uh, getting your driver's license, or, or uh, having a driver's license, or getting, to, getting your driver's license, getting a job, networking with people, social life, all this other stuff. That's responsibility, that's, that's independency. Going outside, going to the gym, uh, have, learning new skills, being bettering yourself, being healthy, watching what you eat. Tell your mom, or oh, can you please, please don't put too much sugar on this, or can you please, like, you know, uh, uh, have this, make this for the day, you know, help tell your mom what, what, to, what to cook so, so, so to understand you, to understand what, what you want to be in the future, what you want to what you want to be healthy in the future. All that stuff is responsible and independency without you getting to suffer financially. I will never leave my parents' house until I'm married. Simple as that. I'm laughing because imagine at age 18 looking like a dickhead leaving your parents' house. Not for university. Just for independence and responsibility. Dickhead. Anyways, thank you for watching. See you next week. Bye. Goofies.